Hi there, Celia Gates back and it's day five of my 60 day challenge and I thought I'd actually take today to explain a little bit about what this challenge was. I know there's been some confusion as to what exactly the Global Entrepreneurship Congress is, whether I'm doing a 60 day challenge or a 30 day challenge and why indeed I'm doing it in the first place. Well, I've run out of time today because I've run out of natural daylight and in thinking about why I'd run out of time, I've had a very busy day, I've been rushing around making plans and getting things happening but the how we manage time and what time actually is sort of sprung to mind as I was thinking about what I was going to say today. So what is time? Well time's really the rate at which change occurs. You know if we're starting at A, if that's the kind of point that we're at right now and we want to get to B, well time is the measure at which that change, at which that distance is covered at which that change actually occurs. So if we can start to bring about the rate from which we travel from A to B, if we shorten that distance, if we speed up the rate at which we travel through it, then effectively we're making more use of time. So to shorten what I'm sort of trying to say right now is basically the reason why I'm doing this is for a number of different reasons. I'm taking myself to point B in as short a space of time as possible and I'm doing that via this 60 day challenge. Now I'm doing that in a build up to this wider congress, this global entrepreneurship congress that takes place in Liverpool in March and I'm hoping to run the global brainstorm in conjunction with that so as to really provide the congress with a window to the rest of the world on the internet. Now that's going to be really inspiring, it's also going to be an opportunity for people to generate lots of ideas and for us to bring about that point B change in as short a space of time as possible. But in the meantime, there are 30 other women who are all joining me on a 30 day challenge to blog about their businesses, to present these videos, these short snippets and tips for information for you to absorb. And I'm actually gonna step forward and say to you girls that I'd like to reach out the wider audience with these posts that we're doing. I know that the information can be of a lot of value to a lot of people. And so Karen and Max, with you in mind, here are 30 potential modern muses emerging. And for you, the ladies who are taking part in this 30 day challenge with me, thank you for inspiring me and getting me going in the first place. But for those of you who actually complete the 30 day challenge, I'd like you to invite you to become a modern muse with me. And what that means is that you accept responsibility to go out and inspire and empower and encourage other women to be more entrepreneurial in their mindset, to make the difference that they know they truly deserve. So thanks for sharing this with me. Thanks for listening. Please do add your comments onto this site. I'm longing to know what you think or if you've got any specific questions you'd like me to answer as we run through these daily posts. And in the meantime, take care. Share your greater growth with the wider world. Thanks for listening.